All right, this is what Betsy's been waiting for, mm -hmm. I know. NASA's most powerful rocket sitting on the launch pad. Right now, the Artemis is set for liftoff in just four days, the first step for humanity's return to the moon. I'm so excited to get down there, but uh, NBC's Lester Holt got the primo assignment. He wanted to try his hand at being an astronaut. So NASA, being NASA, gave him, being Lester, exclusive access to mission training at Johnson Space Center. Look at him there, swapping out his suit and tie for that orange space suit. Uh, is, and I should say, astronaut Jessica Meir joined him, a member of the Artemis team, of course. The two train inside this mock-up of the Orion capsule. Tell me about these suits we're wearing. Uh, obviously very complicated. What, what does this essentially give us? Yeah, so this is called the Ox suit. It's actually an advanced version of the, the same orange suit that you saw for the space shuttle program, but it's a pressure suit. So basically it is providing the pressure that we need if we were to experience a depressurization in the spacecraft in order to keep us alive. So it gives us, we have oxygen hooked up to it, we have temperature control, and we have that pressure to protect us from the vacuum of space. So once, once my visor and everything is down, I'm totally protected. Yes, absolutely. Well, next on Nightly News, Lester finds out what it's like to drive and walk on the moon. I have actually been working on the Artemis project. I am going down there on Saturday. I will be live at Kennedy Space Center coming up on Sunday. And then also Monday, we have a big special airing at 730 to take you inside Artemis. Very excited because NASA Glenn and Cleveland played a huge role in all of this. But it is a coming together of decades of technology and experience and design all coming together in one rocket. She's very passionate about this. Yeah, it's going to be makes amazing. It exciting. I am so excited. Now, it's supposed to go up 8.30 in the morning, 8.33 in the morning on right. Monday. If it does not, there's a two-hour launch window. If they miss that window, it's going to push to later in the week. And hopefully they have three chances to get it up this month. Otherwise, it's going to yeah. be waiting. So, Becky's, she's packing for... Four, four days, days or ten days. <laughs> Something it's, around it's there. It's a very interesting si suitcase situation. And then there's all this stuff for TV that has to get in there, like tripods yeah. and cameras yeah, yeah, yeah. and stuff that my co-dog is.